Hello, I'm the name is Sunshop Gamer, and today I will be expressing my thoughts on the iOS 14 update. So, the iOS 14 update is a one which is basically a convenience update. So, Apple, uh, for, for a very long time now, has not allowed um, the users to add their own widgets, slash their own accessibility sort of shortcuts. But now, it changes. It changes. So, welcome to the iOS 14 update. This update has a start of things to work for, for example, adding widgets, as you can see here, from third-party sites and from Apple themselves. So now, as you can see, I have a whole lot of widgets here. So there's actually one widget here, which is a custom widget, which I'm installed by using an app called the Scholar Widgets. Um, by the way, this is not the paid promotion. I've just recommended this site, uh, an app which I use. So yeah, now, um, how to add widgets? This is the number one question which everyone will ask. So to do that, what you need to do is click on your home screen where there's no uh, apps. For example, this um this little blank area on my home screen. So I'll just press and hold, and then I see all of the apps start to vibrate. Now what you need to do is click on the plane, and you can add widgets. These are all of the widgets which you can add. So yeah, these are all the widgets which you can add. And which will help you. Now, the second thing which I really like about this up there is that uh, I can set my finally I can set my default mail application to Gmail, which is the mail which I use. So what you need to do for that is go over to your settings application and then down over and find um, the mail application which you need or your uh, default browser which you want to set. So for me, I find Gmail and then click on default mail app and now you can select um, the actual app which you want to use, which is pretty nice. So yeah. Now the next thing in this update is that you can actually, um, you actually have an app draw. So um, in many Android phone, uh, in, in many Android phones, if you just swipe up, then you get an app draw. But then now in the iOS 14 update, you can just go over to the last page and then here is your app library. If you click on search, then all of the apps are sorted in an alphabetical order. So that is really good about the iOS 14 updates. These are my initial thoughts on the Unstopped Camera Channel. Um, I'll make a full depth uh, I, I, I'll make a full in-depth review on this topic if you guys smash uh, no, 10 likes. And yeah, hope you guys have a good one and bye. This is Unstopped Gamer. Signing off.